Yeah, you know, Pac-10s, I think, is, is what you really, the season, that's where really the season begins. Uh, you know, what we've done before this, it, you know, it doesn't really count. It's all about these next two tournaments. You know, Pac-10s, we're going there to win as a, individuals, and we're going to go in there to win as a team. Yeah, you know, we have six ranked guys. I mean, I think they've all uh, you know, earned their rankings. I think they've all done a pretty good job. I think at one time we could add another couple guys in there, but uh, you know, right now I think Colby Covington's led, led the way for us this year. You know, he's ranked the highest of anybody, ninth. Uh, Kelly Kubek's not not too far behind. Keegan Davis is you know top 12, top 13. So it's always good to have that ranking. It gives you confidence going in as a season, and then help. And the more guys you get ranked, the more it's uh, confidence for your team. Now, Boise State, they've won the last two, two Pac-10s. You know, they beat us in dual meets this year. So, you know, you, a lot of times it always helps to have that team to shoot for. And that's kind of what, what we're doing. We're, we're, we're kind of trying to knock them off, off the Pac-10 uh, title this year. And I think it just helps us. You know, I think it helped us going in there, even though we got beat the last you know, two weeks ago. It helps us, you know, with our preparation for the Pac-10 tournament. You know, I think, you know, most of our guys are prepared, but I think, you know, you, you know, you got to look at maybe like a guy like Dan Bruschetta, who's the kind of, you know, got a spot mid midway through the year. He's wrestled real well, you know, since he's gotten the spot. You know, the one match we did lose against the Oklahoma, and a kid, he was in the match, he was leading. So, uh, you know, I look, I look for, you know, for him to, if anybody can step up, he's a guy that could step up and surprise a lot of people, but I don't think he'll, he won't really be a surprise to coaches just because of the job he's done lately. You know, I think, well, you know, I, I could say six or seven guys, you know, and then we can maybe got a few guys on that bubble. I think Larris probably already qualified himself. Quebec, Mangrum is kind of on that bubble. You know, you know, Pena maybe on that bubble a little bit. Keegan's probably qualified. You know, Covington. So you know, I think we got six or seven guys that are probably qualified, and three guys probably got to do the job down to Pac-10 tournament.